Hello everyone, News 8 Meteorologist Leanne Byer here, and today we're here to talk about a little bit of some weather folklore. So, growing up, I don't know if it was the same for a lot of you, but I constantly heard the saying from my parents, Red skies at night, sailors delight. Red sky in morning, sailors take warning. And so, that kind of was a peak of my interest where sometimes like I would think about it and then I realized how much I liked weather so I would sometimes you know read about it and everything and this actually got brought to my attention because I was talking about it with one of my good friends yesterday and they were like is that saying actually true so I said you know what that's actually a good post for all of you to read so let's talk about it Red sky in morning, sailors take warning. Red sky at night, sailors delight. So let's talk about the sunrise first. So, sun rises from the east, essentially, and we start to see some clouds, clouds to our west. Sky is red, so the storm movement is moving towards the east. You know, all low pressure systems move from west to east in the northern hemisphere. Then we have some light scattering off of the sun and with longer wavelengths that's where we get to see the reds and the oranges and little bits of some yellows so now those the scattering light is reflecting off of the storm clouds that are moving closer to us which essentially is reflecting to our eyes and basically that's what we're seeing so when we have storms that are moving in from the east so we have a high pressure to our east but a low pressure to our west that's when we get the red morning so that's where we get the saying red red in morning sailors take warning but let's talk about sunsets now so this is now sun setting in the west as most sunsets do clouds now are to our east and remember the movement of low pressure systems west to east. So now we have storms moving to our east, leaving us with clear skies and essentially a high pressure system. So now again that's reflecting off of the clouds back to our eyes and we have storms retreating. So when we when we say reds at night, it's sailors delight because that means the storms are moving out of the area and we are left with an area essentially of high pressure. So is this true? It is mainly true, yes. It only works in some areas though, and I believe the specific areas is the westerlies, which is about 30 degrees to 60 degrees latitude in both the northern and southern hemisphere. Rochester's latitude degree is right around 43 degrees, so we do fall into that category. We get to experience this, or not experience it, I guess we could use the saying correctly, anything else out of that area falls into the easterlies, which is something that we call trade winds. So. I hope you learned something new today, and as always, if you ever have any weather question, go ahead, feel free to email me, or you can reach me via social media, and I will be more than happy to do one of these explainer videos and articles about it, but for now, I'll see you guys soon.